morning, Fit Fam. It's Em, and I'm here to do a What I Ate today on Weight Watchers Smart Points. If you're interested to see what I ate on 30 Smart Points, then stay tuned oh, for this video. My house got painted. Yay. And I'm loving it. I got some new curtains in my dining room. And then I also got some in my living room. If you can guess the channel, then you win a prize. <laughs> um... Yeah, so I'm loving these curtains. I do need to get two more shams, though, for this window because, as you can see, it's a large window and the shams, like, are not shams, panels. They only reach to, like, there. And then they're straight, so. Yeah, so I've been doing some stuff like that. My weekend was okay. I didn't fully vlog just because it was, like, absolutely crazy. But I, my plan was not to binge eat, not to um, eat too bad because I know I was like doing tons of things. Um, it was kind of hard for me not to be home or hard for me to be home from Friday through Sunday because of like the painting and then my dad was going away and so I was, yeah, anyways. So it was just like a busy weekend. Starting good today. I have um, rhubarb apple muffins that are only um, two smart points each in the oven. Actually, I'll run them through the recipe builder again because I actually made this little tiny mistake because I was making the recipe with Ellie and I look, I was doing it, trying to do it quickly because we have playgroups soon and I did one and a half cups of cashew milk instead of the half a cup. So then I put slightly less applesauce and added like an extra handful of oats. So... <laughs> I hope they turn out, but they smell really good. They should be two points per muffin. And yeah, I'm really excited. So I'm going to have one of those for breakfast. So far I've just had a glass of water, but yeah, I'll take, maybe I'll take, I'll eat one and I'll take one with me to play group. And then for lunch, I will probably have a bento box of some sort and prep some for the week since I haven't yet um, done my prep for the week. I do work tonight, so I'm hoping to get my lunch prep and some meal prep done before work tonight during the kids' nap. So that's the plan. And Bachelorette's on tonight. Who's excited to see Rachel as the Bachelorette? I am. I'm excited to get past the first week. Pardon? I'm say, muffins aren't ready yet. Do you want to show everyone your outfit? Grandma got you that for Easter. So, anyways, I'm really excited to see Rachel as a bachelorette. I like the first episode, but it's not my favorite every season. It's just because it's just kind of like long, and I get excited to see the dates and see them get more personal together. But I do like who she gave the first impression rose to. Um, I think that they definitely had a connection. Let me know down below if you guys are watching who you're rooting for, and we can start a discussion every week after the bachelorette yay yay all right guys i'm going to finish getting ready and when i pull the muffins out i will show you say bye hey. say yay I muffins I should, I should. who got you your shirt Lisa. grandma Mama. <laughs> say bye Lisa. can you count not totally four five six what's after six I told you for that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And ten, ten. Eight, nine, ten, you big boy. Bye. <laughs> We're done and look promising, so I'll let you know. I'll let you know. I wanted to show you guys something I picked up at Weight Watchers, and um, it's the new journal. <clears throat> it says, say hello to a brand new day. It comes with a bunch of different sticker sayings. I'm not sure where my extra stickers went, to be honest. Um, but I'm going to start using it today. I was waiting to do start on a Monday. So, oh, actually, they're in the front. So you get like a, a thing of letters. And you get a thing of different sayings. So you can put these over top of the existing ones or probably peel it back. Because the cover is um, really smooth, so you probably could peel it back. These stickers are also very good I had to peel peel one up and um, put it back down on the paper page and it went well but like they don't peel up on their own so the other ones say not uh, progress not perfection you got this 
keep on keeping on, dream big, and life is full of possibilities. So you can put that on for motivation. I'll flip through it quick for you guys. In the, be in the front, I just use the stickers to write M. Wilson. And then it kind of gives you some ideas on tracking. Track honestly, if it helps, split the tracker page into meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner. Um, so I plan to decorate this like a planner and I'm going to keep it in my purse. So you just have like day one, day two. What are you doing? Um, and then it has like your total smart points and weeklies and then any activity you do. Okay, I will. Just because right now that the kids are playing and there's Dora in the background, but I've kind of decided sometimes it's hard for me, especially on non daycare days. Um, it's hard for me to just get rid of children noise. So um, if I'm going to vlog, I'm going to vlog. Anyways, um, it has little quotes here as well. So some days you just have to create your own sunshine. Gives you a little bit of. And then at the end of each week, so this is day seven, it has a reflection page. So you can stuff to remember, recap, weekly recap, taking care of yourself. So I was thinking I'm going to do my recap with you guys every Monday for the, follow for the previous week. So that way you guys can see. And then there's also some journaling pages. And then week two. So then it has a little picture. And it's kind of the same thing with a different color. And then down here it says what week you're on. So the nice thing about plan tracking your food on paper is that you can look back um, more easily. So if you know you had a week where you lost well, you can see what you were eating, um, how many points you were eating each day, what kind of meals you were eating. Um, because maybe you'll have a week that you gain and you're like, oh, like... I just don't know what to eat or I was having a hard time. You can look back at the weeks you did do well and I plan to like have a, on every Wednesday, I'll write my weigh-in and I might mark it at the top. My weigh-in days or like tab it down. Um, but yeah, so like another reflections page. And then I don't know if there's anything else specific to show you guys, but basically it's just a really cute little journal. There's more journaling stuff in the back. Um, I like that you can put a quote on it. I like that it's black. It draws a bit less attention. Oh, <laughs> I could put my initials here as well. I didn't even realize that that was there. So that's probably what the letters are for, but that's okay. So I'm going to close this guy up. There's also a thing to mark where you're at, which is nice. I have to put my breakfast in once I have it. I haven't had my muffin yet. I'm waiting to have it. Anyways, I feel like sometimes using technology takes a little bit of the, I don't know, something about putting it down on paper, something that can't be ignored. Um, you have to flip through a page to get to the new page, something about it for me. Every time I track on paper, it always keeps me on plan. So anyways, I did want to mention to you, a lot of people that were in my Step Into Tracking, the New Year group, have been asking about a new Step Into Tracking challenge. I know in March when I did it, I totally dropped the ball, probably because I, um, I think I had my fall in March, didn't I? I don't even know. I had my fall in um, the New Year challenge. Anyways, we are going to start something on Wednesday. Okay. We are going to start something on Wednesday, and... It's going to be my weekly weigh-in because I want to get to 150 before my trip in September. So it's going to be my weekly weigh-in and it's going to have a challenge for the week and um, a quick step into tracking recap as well. Um, I'm not going to do like, um, I'm not going to label every video step into tracking. I'm just going to recap it at the end of the week and then if I think to update in a vlog about how that day is going as far as steps and water and um, tracking, then I will do that. But I felt feel like whenever I've done the challenge previously, it's hard for me to remember to just post it every single day and I don't, I need it to be a little bit more of a relaxed schedule. So if I update on Wednesdays with my weight and with the challenge of the week and um, about how last week went, then that's what my plan is to do. If you guys want to check out the Facebook page and you haven't yet went there, it's called hashtag STTNY with M. Wilson Fit Fam. So it's, it was step into tracking the new year. 
with Emma Slim Fit Fam. So right now, that's what it is. I will link it down below if you guys want to go check it out. Um, we're probably starting Wednesday, but you can come in at any time. And then also on my Wednesday video, I'd love for you guys to comment how you guys did. Use the comments to like connect with other people that are also on Step Into Tracking. Maybe make accountability partners if you need one. Post it here or post it to the Facebook page. People um, in the past with as far as accountability partners, if you post it on, our, on the Facebook page, people were meeting up and they were making great friends and they were really helping keep each other motivated. So let me know. And if you are having a hard time finding one, I will um, try to help with that as well. But yeah, so that's that. I got to get going now to playgroup. My kids are getting into some things. Got to get out to playgroup, pack my muffins, and get going for the day. Say that whitening your teeth during nap time or like prime snack time, in my opinion, really helps. So yeah, doing that. When these are done, I'm going to have lunch. Maybe I should do it next time. I'll do lunch and then put these in right away. And then, I'm not sure what I'm having for lunch yet. What should I have? I have to plan for tonight's meeting. And yeah. So I'm just sitting down to have my lunch. It is 11 smart points. I'm gonna turn you around and show it to you. All right, so I have a whole can of soup. Um, some of the broth is still in the pot, but the can of this was four points. It's reduced sodium, chicken noodle. It's like a no frills brand. Um, so anyway, so that's four points. And then I have um, a seven smart point little sandwich. It's just this sweet bun for five points. Um, four slices of turkey breast for one and then um, 17 grams of cheese for one and then there's like three sprays of spray butter and some hot sauce so that's seven this is four we're at 11 have some water and Ellie's photo of Blanche or Branch or whatever his name is and yeah I'm gonna eat this and then try to prep for my meeting today. can I just say how exciting today is like who doesn't love getting packages in the mail I got just got this in the mail and it's the first ever Canadian like spring box box it's like supposed to be like a whole bunch of favorites or something so after lunch I'm gonna film a unboxing of this guy so I'll link it down below if you haven't yet seen it um, I also got my new firm glasses in the mail which I have to f I'm going to make a video on those because they are like my new spring ones and I tried out a tint, so I wanted to give you guys a little mini review on that. And my teeth whitening trays came, which is why I was whitening. <laughs> it's just like a fun day of adventure. Oh, these are my new glasses. If you want to see what I think about them, I'll put the link down below. Um, okay, one fried egg for two smart points, a toasted English muffin for four. I have some spray butter and some jelly on one half of it. Um, yeah, so I'm going to have a six smart point something, and then I will have nine points later on tonight to do something with. Um, I'm just not hungry enough to, for, like, a big meal right now, but I'm, like, hungry, so I don't want to leave for Napani and then feel like I'm getting... I don't want to have a half an hour drive, feel hungry, and then get something on the way or get something on the way home. I just want something that's going to satisfy me, so I'm going to have this. Maybe I will pack an apple for after. And yeah, do you want to say hi? Yeah. Nope. Whoop! Did you fall? Uh-huh. <laughs> All right, guys, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, so I'm just editing the vlog and realized I didn't finish my vlog for yesterday. So basically, I finished off my day. I went to get groceries after my meeting and then I had nine points left and I wasn't even really hungry. Then I did an unthinkable and got a butter tart and I ate that and I tracked it for nine points because I saw butter tart in there for nine points. So I just did that and uh, yeah. So actually no, it said eight. I think I found butter tart for eight points. So I had one point left. Regardless, it could have been more points than that and it is what it is. I, for the most part, was really good all day and I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.